Team Leopard 1110 presents Distributing Your Work Via Technology Using the Film Strip Editing Theme. And we are Travis Schooner, Miranda Showers, Daniel Tompkins, Jenna Sarney. Cameron Scott. Team Leopard 1110. Distributing your work. Presented by me. There are lots of social media websites in the world today, like Facebook, Twitter, and SoundCloud. But one of these stands out from the rest, and that is YouTube. YouTube gets people's names out there and allows people to go from your average person to an internet sensation with only one upload. You may recognize these YouTube stars. Numa Numa's Gary Brolsma and Gangnam Style's Psy. Neither expected such success. But thanks to YouTube, they have over 510 million views collectively. And thanks to YouTube, it became possible. So upload your video. Use the technology to your advantage. Distributing your work by me, Miranda Showers. Did you know that social media marketing refers to the process of attracting attention through social media websites, such as Twitter and Facebook? In my own opinion, social media is the fastest and less expensive way to go about distributing your work. On this website, it clearly shows you strategies to build a website. If you scroll down, you'll see that it has step one of your social marketing plan, have a strong web presence goes down to step two know your audience it continues on down to show you several different steps on how you can better distribute your work here's a diagram just showing you all the social websites that are out there researching a little further I found another social media website that breaks the websites down Facebook Twitter LinkedIn breaks down the photo sharing sites and blogs. When you see these social media site logos, don't click the X. Use this as a tool to distribute your work. Produced by Miranda Showers. The evolution of game distribution by Daniel Tompkins. The video game industry has only recently reached mainstream media status. From classics like Super Mario to Pokemon to new titles like Angry Birds. These familiar faces are everywhere you go. This was not always the case due to the social stigma video games initially carried. If you couldn't find the game you wanted at your local electronics store, you were out of luck. But as the video game industry grew, so too did the ways to distribute games. Most major department stores began to stock games, and stores dedicated entirely to games started popping up. With the advent of the internet, it became easy to find almost any game, new or old, and have it delivered to you. 
Digital distribution also became popular, allowing gamers to download games directly onto their console or PC without the use of a disc. Developers are always looking for new ways to get their games into the hands of consumers. Distributing Your Story Presented by me, Jenna Sarney Writing is as old as time, and not much about the art has changed over the years. However, technology is an ever-changing thing, and its influence on how we accomplish tasks is strong to say the least. How writers go about distributing their work has been greatly impacted by technology. Especially when it comes to... Social media. Writers Guild of America West new media program manager Tamara Krinsky says, There is no one way to describe how writers are using social media. It's all in the interpretation. Many writers use social media to advertise their shows. Others may use it as a way to tell their new stories. And some writers use social media to see how people respond to their jokes and sense of humor. Miss Krinsky says, when you talk about Twitter, you're talking about writing. Image-based social media does exist, but most social media has something to do with the written word, so there is always room for writers to explore. Tamara Krinsky says, as there is more content in the world for consumers to navigate, developing a brand becomes more important, and social media can help writers do that. Moral of the story, keep tweeting. It could lead to your next big break. <laughs>